So you went through Union Square? Yes, I did. I just, uh, it's still kind of going on right now. I can hear helicopters from my window. It's, um, it's hectic. It's hectic in New York City. Man. Why, why don't you go out there right now and bring your Discord camera? Why are you trying to get me killed? <laughs> You know, the old Sneeko, I know would have done it. You know what I mean? But I don't know. Maybe you, you just changed You know the them. old Sneeko? I what, did. What you, you never... I did a little bit. I just think the old Sneeko would have done it, you know? But I don't know. Okay. If I go out on my Discord camera, um, what, what do I have to yell? Um, um, I don't know. Whatever you want. Say the N word right now. No. Just don't let me go out there, bro, because you know what? They're going to try to put a way for you to drag me and you involved in it. I'm endorsing you to go out there. I I'm not trying to – no, we're not doing that, no. No, 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 no. Yeah, so, so what do you think about um, – should, should we lock up that – is, is Kai a thug? No, it's not Kai that's the thug. It's the people that were jumping on cars, destroying businesses, and causing havoc and chaos. Those people deserve to get charged, 100%. If they're children, they deserve to have some type of – Discipline. They they need something to wear. I saw a bunch of people surrounding a car, jumping on a car, and and they were getting super happy, and they were like, "Yeah, yeah, yeah!" Like they need to, they need some type of punishment. I don't care what anybody says. They're children. I get it. They need some type of punishment for sure. You know, they're not going to charge any of those people. Like in BLM, they didn't charge any of the people that were smashing windows and jumping on cars and letting the cops. So who they charge? People... What's that? So Kai, Kai officially just got charged. He officially just, just now. Yeah, he officially just got charged. They, uh, they're saying he's going to face multiple charges. Um, so it's not just one charge. I thought they were just going to charge him with incitement of riot. And Travis Scott had that charge back in, like, I think, 2017 in, like, a small town in Minnesota. And what did Travis do? He just bailed himself, right, Chad? I think it was just a quick bail. But if it's multiple charges, it's an ongoing case. But here's the thing, Sneeko, and you tell me your thoughts. I, 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 I love AMP. Every member in there I've known for years. I know you have your, you know, you know him too. This is the thing, bro. This is the thing. They, they, they couldn't expect this thing to be clean. Obviously, like it was, there was obviously going to be some type of issues and situation. They're too fucking big. You understand what I'm saying? So what I'm trying to get at is I don't blame them for people doing the fuck shit to certain people. But them doing this, it's just... I wish somebody would have been like, hey, guys, be, be, this got to be organized more. I wish somebody would have been in their ear like, hey, bro, you can't just do this. Your guys are too big. Does that make sense? Right. So you think that if you did a, if you did a giveaway like that, you would have been fine? The fuck? Um, no, like, so, like, would you need to have a handler? Or do you, you think you, you probably wouldn't have decided to riot? It, it would have been like, it would have been, it would have went smoothly. No, I'm not saying that. There would have probably been way less people, but... You know, he went to his hometown. He's been there months. He was giving away hella shit with Phantom. So much hype built up and stuff. You know, it's just, it was, it was, no, I mean, I don't think, I, I, I've done that before. I did that in LA. Um, like last second, I took like two hours before I, I, I tweeted out this thing. And technically if something would have happened, I would have probably gotten charged. So I got swatted that day. Okay, but you, like you didn't, you didn't have to face charges. What what are the charges that he's facing? Anybody know? Inciting a riot. There's a couple inciting riot charges that they said they're gonna do. Okay. P people are yes, saying no because you have white and Mexican fans. It's different. Chat. I'm gonna just say here and sneak. I'll let you touch base on it. It's not because they're black. Okay. It's because of how they were raised, and it's because um, it's nothing to do with skin color or race. Huh? Go ahead. What, what do you What do you think is the reasoning why these people acted out? Oh, like what, you, wait, wait, why? You, I never said anything about race. You're saying that, like, are you trying to say that the I monkeys were jumping on cars? No, I never said there were monkeys were jumping on. <laughs> well, well, I don't even know why you brought that up. I was just talking. About, I'm just trying to figure out what happened no. to Kai, and now you're trying to say that they're monkeys for twerking on top of the poles and they're thugs <laughs> no, for, no, for no, jumping no. on top of moving cars. Well, I mean, let's be honest. Okay, okay. If you want to talk about race, have you ever seen a group of Asians? <laughs> throw cones in the middle of a street fight no. i haven't no I, i'm half asian you know i'm part black too i've never seen a chinese mob throw cones for because of a <laughs> ps5 fair enough i mean but them be just okay so what are you saying it why did these people act the way they acted why did they do this it's encouraged by the culture same reason blm nobody cared about george floyd like they all just everybody in new york and i was i was running around too it's just it was fun we were all trapped inside you want to run around and have fun that's what you i'm saying i think it was just fun people joined in like cheap 
That's what I'm trying to tell you. There was probably so many people in Union Square. It's a Friday fucking night in the summer. And I just genuinely think that like a lot of kids showed up. Everyone, like, what the fuck's going on? I want to come in too. I want to join in too. I think people didn't even know what was going on joined in. I just think it was a bunch of just like spreading word and shit. Everyone just lined up and just joined the fuck in. I think it was, you're right. I, I think it was just people wanted to have some fun. But why do, what, okay, so if you want to, you want to make it about race hating so we can talk about race. I'm not. Why do Chinese I, I, people, go ahead. no, 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 but like I, white people fun is different. Like white people in New York City right now, it's all these interns coming in from Westchester and Connecticut. They're singing, hey, soul sister. Hey, soul sit on the train, right? Nobody's stabbing each other. There's no fires. There's no cones. Why is it that when people from the hood are having fun, they have to go burn stuff down and let out fireworks in public. The guy, the guys who assaulted that sixty-year-old man and it fucked up his business deserve to all get punished. I don't care. You, you're messing with a man who's trying to break up shit's business. And I agree with you. Why, why did it get like that? I don't know. I don't think it's about race. I think it's about how they're raised. I don't think it's about race at all. I don't. I think it's about how you're raised. I think that's that's. Okay, so who, who is predominantly? doing this i mean you know the answer bro i'm not gonna I'm say it you i asked you you made it about race so who's predominantly Fair beating enough. up old men who's predominantly doing all the stuff um the people yeah. that weren't raised properly i said it <laughs> wait are you saying black people weren't raised properly no i never said that what are, we, what are you talking about no i never said I that shit just said. no i didn't i'm bro i told you it's never been about race for example i'll give you an example right now ready i'm ready okay hear me out so listen, sneaky up. Let's just say Joe Schmo who assaulted that 60 year old guy in his business, right? Let's just say I grew up with Joe Schmo. Me, I'm white, I'm Jewish, matter of fact, okay? I grew up with him, went to the same school with him. Um, um, we, we, we went through the same shit. You know, I've had incidents where, you know, I, I, I've seen crazy shit, he's seen crazy shit. He's been through some fights and shit. Maybe I have too, you know what I'm saying? Boom, so, hold on, so, I would have most likely been with Joe Schmo. Do you understand what I'm saying? Because I was raised like Joe Schmo. Okay. But you have to admit, though, even though it's raised a certain way, why are certain races raised certain ways? Like you see Kiki Palmer, for example, she just got up on stage at Rolling Loud and she started off a song after twerking on Usher. And even though she's a baby mom and she's raising a kid, she got up on stage at Rolling Loud and she said, I don't need a nigga. All I need's a bag. And everyone cheers. And she's basically I saying, agree. I that's, don't need- I agree, it's cringe. Like that, that shit is weird to me. I don't give a fuck who you are. That's, that, I agree, I agree. But there's a culture, there's certain, like family values are important in Asian culture. Like an Asian person would never get up on stage and do that. So you and are, like, you're, are you, are you, you are Chinese? You, you're Chinese? I'm not Filipino. Okay, so Sneeko, you, okay, so I, okay. It's just about how you're raised and it's about culture. Yes, it is. It is, bro, but you can't just say, I'm not gonna sit here and say, there's black people in my chat. If you're black, say me. There's black people in my chat that have, that are, that, have edu that, are, that are educated and know not to do that fuck shit. They know that. They know that, right, bro. But, That's the most, but, but here's, here's like the, the red pill is like, in America, most aren't. Because black culture does promote a lot of degeneracy. If you listen to the music, if Rap, you listen I to get the it. Movie, I know, I know, I know, I get it, bro. I get it. It's all promoting certain shit and it's all fuck fucked up shit in your ear. I know, dude, trust me, I fucking know. But it's just, uh, okay, so who's at fault for all this? I wanna ask you, I, I, I answered what I what my, my opinion was. What do you, what is, break, give me the breakdown. Who's at fault for all this? I think, I think Kai and Phantom are innocent. I don't think that they should be held responsible. Like they just said they were gonna do a giveaway. They clearly didn't want to incite a riot. It I wasn't their intention. Yeah, they, they I think the intention is extremely important. I think they left really quickly. Everybody stayed out afterwards. And I think that if they're going to get everybody in trouble for that, then they should have prosecuted everybody for the BLM riots. And they didn't. Clearly, New York City doesn't really care about this. I don't really think anyone's going to get in that much trouble. New York doesn't really care about this type of crime. And this is why I left. You can't be in a city with a bunch of this liberal mentality because if they prosecute everybody, they're going to play the race card. Even if you look at all the police that are like on on the news and the, the police who are part of this this case and the. They're mostly black. Like they have this narrative that white cops are racist, but like 90% of the policemen who are involved with this are black. So it's not really it's true. like black people are victims thing. I think that they shouldn't face any charges, but also I, I think it's important to look at like- well, what hold the on, let me just say doing. one thing, please. Because listen, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you right now, I agree with, uh, with like basically with everything you're saying. However, I do think that, I, I would think that there should nothing that should be happening to them, but it says here, Kai Sinai will be charged with multiple counts of inciting a riot and unlawful assembly, multiple. Now we don't know how much that is. Multiple is more than one, right? So 
what I'm trying to say is realistically what I believe should happen. And, 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 and again, I'm not speaking for Kai because I think Kai will make things right as he is because he's, that's who Kai is. I think Kai, it, when he, when he, when he gets the shit past him, he need, he will, I, cause I know him, like I said, he's gonna, he's gonna most likely make things right and, and fund people who were hurt and all these things. And, 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 you know, that's all he can do. You can just basically learn from it and, and, and learn to give. Basically, people weren't even really hurt. If you look at like that old dude who seemed like he was attacked, he was like, "Oh, my injuries on no, my no, back." No, I saw, I saw a video of a guy. He was bleeding. I, I, okay, I don't know if it's cap because the news is fake. Someone shot themselves. That's what the news article said. But like, that has nothing to do with Kai. Like, you think Kai's be like, "Oh, shoot yourself in the fucking like," you know what I mean? Like, so I, I mean, yeah, I, I just want, I just want. I don't know, bro. This is just, it's super fucked. It's bro. not going to change. It, it's going to get worse. And we're going to see something like this happen every summer. In my opinion, he's innocent. Like he didn't, uh, he's not responsible for, you know, thousands of teens acting wild. I agree. But I think what's important is to look at something like this and see how it's identical to the BLM riots and think about like, why yeah. do, why does the youth feel it's okay to act this way in public? Why is everybody so comfortable? People were like, I was walking around, people were like shooting fireworks, like jumping on statues, fireworks? smashing all- Fireworks, yeah, like, well, I mean, get, maybe you know where they got the idea for the fireworks from, but they're smashing cars, they're mm-hmm. kicking down windows. Like, why do they think, why is this the youth's idea of fun? You know, I just think they're kids, they watch streamers, they watch TikTok, they watch YouTube, they see, you know, we got, people got to understand, man, you're a content creator, content's content, bro. Like, if people do shit on stream, they should know it's content. It's, it's not... I don't know, bro. It's just... It's just content. Honest, so it's no, no. Can I be honest? No, it's not justification. Listen, I'm going to be honest, bro. Kids are only getting dumber. And chat, and y'all know what I'm talking about. Like, 13-year-olds now are stupider than when I, when I was 13. Question, though. Back on this Kai situation. Do you think they're going to... Do you think multiple charges? Do you think... Is that... Can I... Is that just going to be that he pays, like, a, um, a fee, like, a bail, and that's it? Will they drop the charges? How are they going to drop those charges? I hope he could pay his way out of it. He's got to have some good lawyers. Yeah. You can put it up. You make, do you know that? You probably know some good lawyers. My uncle, actually. How'd you know? Oh, I, I was just a guess. I had nothing to do with anything else. My, uh, yeah, my uncle and I, we were celebrating Hanukkah last year, and he told me anytime you ever get into some bullshit, he got me. I said, oh, help Al-Kai. Go bail him out with your connects. What's his last name? Um, what? Oh, never mind, never mind. It's Goodman. Oh, <laughs> I, I, had, I had no idea.